undeniably it is a fixture that always carries an edge we're talking about two colossal clubs and they're about to collide complete live coverage coming up from the emirates it's arsenal against manchester city and a warm welcome from north london we're at the emirates stadium i'm derek ray and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is stuart robson and what better way to ring in the new year than with live football it's arsenal facing manchester city well first of all derek happy new year to you i just hope the players went to bed at a reasonable time as we'd love to see a really good game here to start the new year off with a bank and that is offside And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Thomas Partey starts alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. And a look at the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson stands between the posts. Kyle Walker plays with Joao Cancelo in the fullback positions. Riyad Mahrez plays with Raheem Sterling out wide. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. Foden, but really sticking to the task defensively. Arsenal had too much for their opponents in the win against Wolverhampton Wanderers. How do you anticipate it going this time, Stuart? Well, that 2-0 victory at home was not as easy as the scoreline suggests. They were just better in both boxes. Today, they will be a lot tougher, and I'm expecting a really close game, with neither side quite having enough to win it. You can't help feeling, when you look at the table, that when you're playing dominant football such as they have been, that they're going to lap the field. Well, there seems to be no stopping them at the moment. They've been by far and away the best team. Unless something drastic happens, I can't see how they let this slip. Read it magnificently and intercepted. Bukayo Saka. It's with Erdogan. Partey. Sends it back. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Making sure it didn't get past him. Rodri. De Bruyne. Mares. Ozim Hen. Xhaka. And a good take under duress there. It needs an accurate cross. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. Now a decent position. It looks promising. Xhaka. It might be on for them. And here's Xhaka. Could be troublesome. Cuts it back. Must be! Well, it might still work out for them. Oh, he's given the ball away unnecessarily. Martin Erdegaard. Really good challenge. They're getting in there to intercept. Saka. Oh, what an opportunity! Oh, a save of the highest order. Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. Well, they've been frustrated for quite a while now, but these fans have suddenly come to life. Playing it in and clearing it away. Granite Jacker. Well, possibilities in the centre. Partey. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Sterling. 
And the emphasis is on creativity. Joao Cancelo. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Rodri. And now Sterling. Determined defending. Ozim Hen. Well, they might be onto something. Giving them a different option by moving in field. Must take the lead here. Thomas. Xhaka. And up for grabs off the keeper. And a time for cool heads. Bernardo Silva. De Bruyne now. Riyad Mahrez. Sterling. And he takes on the shot. Superb block. Well, those stats aren't great reading, are they? Neither side is playing with any fluency so far. And as a result, we've seen a pretty dull game. It has to get better. Excellent vision. He's blocked it. Beautifully weighted ball. Interception to snuff out the danger. And so it is. The first half story has been written. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Kevin De Bruyne. Well, just couldn't keep the ball. Martin Odegaard. Now can they make something happen? Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Well, there is the opening goal! The pressure finally telling, and they get the due reward! Well, as you can see, he makes it look easy in the end, but I think that's a good finish. He'll be pleased with that. So underway again here, one nil the score. What a massive transfer story. It is now official, by the way. Kamidou Koulibaly has completed his move to Old Trafford. Well, at about £50 million, pounds, I think he'll prove to be an excellent sign-in. He's certainly got the skill and character to be a real star for them. Forcing opportunity. <laughs> Terrific block. Sterling Foden an inability to keep hold of the ball there can they get in behind them Partey Breaking at pace. Well, they need to get tighter. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. 
And smart defending. Let's just clarify the injury situation. Our man on the side of the pitch is Jeff Shreves. Yeah, keep an eye on him because in that last challenge, he took a heavy blow to his upper thigh. He's feeling it at the moment, but no sign of him last being taken off. Cheers, Jeff. Well, clearly in the mood to make it a double, but fine goalkeeping. Well, he's playing really well today. That was another decent attempt. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. And over it comes. A very effective clearance. Running with the ball confidently. Saka. Cedric. He takes aim. Able to get a body in the way. Partey. Just cutting off the supply. Partey. Clean challenge. The first leg of the Carabao Cup semi-final will be live with us here on EA TV. It's Arsenal facing Manchester City. That will certainly be an interesting first leg, but how will each team approach it? They won't want to go into the second leg behind, so it should be a top-quality game. And teammates to play it to. De Bruyne, and no way through. Bukayo Saka. Tavash. Parte. Xhaka. Oh, a goal for Arsenal! It's theirs to lose now. Well, here it is again, and it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. Well, a second goal for them here. by City plenty of forward momentum here but can they produce oh incredible save and he snuffed out the danger so a personnel change then Delivering it. The clearance wasn't just could pull one back here. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. Played over. Well, given the position he found himself in, he really should be testing the keeper. Superb opportunity squandered. The first leg of the Carabao Cup semi-final will be live with us here on EA TV. It's Manchester City facing Arsenal. Well, I can't wait to see how the coaches set their teams up for that one. Both will want to lead going into the oh, second Stuart, leg. They might be onto something here. Oh, he's only gone and found the net. What purity of hit. Caught it absolutely perfectly. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. 
Five minutes to go. De Bruyne. It's with Gundogan. Walker. Martinez. And a tidy tackle. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. Rodri. Just the challenge that was required. Sterling. Shot attempted. And a body in the way. We're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Gets in the way once more. Deflected behind. Corner forthcoming. And now the delivery. Gundogan. So there it is, the final whistle and a satisfying outcome for Arsenal and the many fans around the world. What did you think of their performance as a whole? You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance. Saka passing it around looking for the goal that would put them ahead well there is the opening goal the pressure finally telling and they get their due reward Well, clearly in the mood to make it a double, but fine goalkeeping. Well, he's playing really well today. That was another decent attempt. Xhaka. Oh, a goal for Arsenal. It's theirs to lose now. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce... Oh, incredible save, and he snuffed out the danger. The clearance wasn't decisive. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. Played over. Well, given the position he found himself in, he really should be testing the keeper. Superb opportunity squandered. Oh, he's only gone and found the net! What purity of hit! Caught it! 